I'm Evelyn Welsh. I'm the Provost for Arts and Sciences here at King's College London and I'm also the Senior Investigator on a Wellcome Trust funded project called Renaissance Skin. What is professional development? Professional development can be so many things. It can be um, finding out what kind of personality you are and how you respond to challenge. It can be understanding how to do spreadsheets in a new kind of way. It can be learning all kinds of new skills. If we all don't involve professional development, we don't grow, we don't develop, we don't become leaders in our own ways. When I started, there was no such thing as professional development for arts and humanities researchers. We rarely got grants. I was awarded a £250,000 Arts and Humanities Research Board grant in the late 1990s. This was more money than my mortgage. I took myself off to learn how to run meetings, to do project management skills, to do time management skills, all of these things which I had to put together myself. I would so love to have had the kind of professional development that's available for King's researchers, technicians, postdocs, etc. today. Please take advantage of what you've got. It makes a big, big difference to learn, not just about yourself, but also about how to work with others. I've run a range of research projects, at their biggest, I've had 39 PIs collaborating with me. At their smallest, it's been myself and a PhD student there. Um, we have involved many, many different people at many different levels, needing many different kinds of skills over time. Every one of my collaborators, researchers, postdocs, support staff has engaged with professional development at some point, primarily to understand themselves so they can understand others better, so that they can develop the skills that they need for professional and personal career development. This can mean many things. It can involve learning a new statistical package. It can involve learning a new form of endnote. It, but it also can mean really understanding yourself, how to manage up, how to manage across, and how to manage those who are working for you. All are absolutely essential for personal and professional development.